What's going on, guys? Um, try not to smack the side of this thing. There we go. All right, what's up? So, gonna make a trip real quick down to Bass Pro. See what kind of stuff we can get into. Hopefully, won't spend too much money. I guess we'll find out. I've really been wanting like, I don't know, I've been wanting a new GoPro. They just came out with a nine. So, I'm going to see what they got. And hopefully, oh, we might pick one up. Who knows? But, see you guys there. All right. Made it back, or back, made it to Bass Pro. We are going to hopefully get a GoPro. Um, depends on what kind of price they got, but hopefully I'll get one of those and get in a few other things, maybe. Uh, we'll see you back and see what we get. All right, well. It's, oh, I don't even know what time it is. I think it's like 7.30. Oh, kind of short. 7.30, 7.40. Um, Bass Pro Trip went all right. We, I mean, I didn't see nothing. That They didn't have any GoPros out tonight. So, fortunately, we'll, we'll have to go out and get another one sometime. But I did. I screwed up the fletchings on one of my arrows the other night. So, got these, what is it? These Hellfire fletchings. That just, I guess they're pre, the pre-packaged ones, you kind of slide them on the arrow and boil them. So, we're going to try to get these on tonight. On at least one of them. I bought, yeah, I bought one arrow tonight because I didn't really, I didn't really need any more. So, went ahead and picked up one of those, picked up these Hellfire Quick Fletch. So, we're gonna see how they do, and uh, yeah, I guess I'll show you how to put them on. So let's go. Well, it's almost through a ball. I forgot I need to take that stuff off of there. So. I think that's, I think that's fairly clean. Oh, hold on. I'm gonna take that knock out. And there we go. Those Hellfire, I'm trying to down Those, those, those Hellfire Quick Fletch. There we go. So I guess you just I'm just gonna throw it on there best I can. Oh that's weird. There we go. I don't know how far I should put it down. I think it'll be alright right there. Look pretty cool. See what we can do. Oh, I'm gonna move that down. All right, you ready? I guess you're supposed to hold it in there for 10 seconds or something. That works. Come on, get brighter. Uh. 
think, I think we're good. I guess we'll just have to let it dry. I'm gonna dip it one more time. good there you go that's pretty easy looks pretty good that's orange i don't know what that is on there but it says they're a lot better than the regular you know like the regular fletchings you put on there so i'm gonna let that dry for a little bit and it's dark right now so i can't can't shoot it today but i'll probably bust it up tomorrow and try to see what we can do with it. Yeah, it looks alright. Just gonna throw that knot back in there. Put that. Line that up. But yeah. If you guys ever need new fletchings on your arrows, I suggest that because. I was not about, well, I almost bought two packs of like the single individual fletchings. They have like 50 in a pack, but I don't have the correct setup to put those on there correctly in the right, in the right pattern, I guess. On the, like the distance from each other. So I just went ahead and got a couple of those and they're only like 10 bucks for pack three, which I think is pretty good. So yeah, we'll have to make another one and see how they shoot. All right, that will have to wrap it up for tonight, guys, but uh, get ready for another one coming tomorrow. We're gonna set, gonna set some good targets up and we're gonna shoot, I think we're gonna shoot that arrow around 20 25 to 45 yards so we'll see how it compares to the other arrows in the group and see see which does better so peace i'll see you next time